Okay, so Kimberly here from Holton Paranormal. Um, we're in a private home this evening. Apparently there's a lot of activity that's been happening around the child that's in the home. Um, tonight we have Kim, Leah, Jeff, myself, and the homeowners. And uh, we're going to see what we can find. I'm already sensing quite a bit, actually, and so is Kim. So we're going to see uh, if we can communicate with anybody that's here and try and help this family out. I'm going to just touch the side of my face. If you can touch me, then you have enough energy to light this light up. A lot of talking from the girls. Do I have to find you? We're playing hide and go seek. Okay, now something's touching my eyes. Like this is not funny. You're just touching. You're poking. You're poking at it. I think you're pretty stupid if you want to just poke at me. you got to do better than that. Again, the face. Go poke Jeff. Give him a good poke. Jeff will be the guy standing over there. He's the only other one in the room. That's, you know, they might think you're half and half or something. I'm just saying the guy. If that was you that made a noise by Leah, can you do it again? You need to talk to us or communicate. We only want to know what you're doing here. So, what was that? That could be them moving around upstairs. No, or? that was like a a click, yeah, like I a quick a, slap or something. I heard a click over here. That was you. Can you keep making noises for us to hear, please? You know what it sounded like over there? One of those old flash cameras that go off. Yeah, like that. Mm -hmm. Like a t Exactly. Yeah, that's what it sounded like. We're probably the only ones that can help you. Whether it's sending a message to the family that lives here, something just touched my back. Yeah. yeah. It's sure a wasn't a No. <laughs> it was a poke. You can touch me, that's okay. I don't mind. But we're the only ones here, Lee and I and Kimberly. I'm not going to say Jeff because he can't <laughs> help you. But, um... Yeah, that's a lost cause. Yeah, we can help you give a message to the family. We can help you go to a better place so you can have peace. Do you want to have peace? Do you like that we're here visiting you right now? That was um, Jacqueline. She went, wow. Yeah, what? You didn't say anything? No. You didn't go, wow? No. Did you hear that? Yeah. No. Did you, Jacqueline, Scott, did you hear that? I didn't say anything, but I didn't hear anything. Really? Was your recorder over there? I heard that there? loud as loud and clear. Is your recorder over there? That's right here. There's one right here. Yeah, I don't know if it would pick up that. Just turn it off for a few minutes. Every time I leave. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to move it from that. See if I move it from another position and see. Oh, you know why? No, she opened the door. Oh, that's why. It's on the floor. The cold air is on the floor. I don't know if I'm going to All right, is there anybody in here with us? I saw this glove and I thought you shut the, the, the display off. As soon as you sat down, it went off. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so when you move again, if it goes off, I'll let you know. I thought that was just what it does. I don't know your camera, so. Yeah. I can burn it right now. Yep, I do when my kids downstairs go live. And uh, that'll be the end of this. The best bet is to clean through it now. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay, something just pulled my hair. Oh, really? Right. Yes. Is your camera on you? Yes, the video camera is right at the back of my freaking head. If you just pulled me a hair, can you really do it again? Give it a good tug like you just did. That won't hurt you. It can't hurt you. Come close. I'm the friendly one of the group. Oh, my camera just got shut off. Oh, nice. Been a long time since that happened.